creating a great character rig for your 3D character is a key element if you want to have a stunning animation. And unfortunately, the default tool that Blender offers have some drawbacks that can cause you to spend way more time rigging your character. But thanks to the folks at Pata's Animation, you now have a solution. Pata's Rigging Tools is an in-house tool turned public by the studio. This growing collection of helper tools was born out of necessity from the Pata's Animation lead riggers after getting frustrated with tedious operations and dangerous defaults, which can break a rig in an instance. Pata's Rigging Tools makes generating Rigify rigs a much easier and flexible process as well as simplifies and improves the often repetitive weight painting process and with all of that it keeps getting better. Now the Pata's Rigging Tools is divided into two parts. First we have a helper to generate Rigify rigs and second we have a set of, of operators to help you in your weight painting. Rigify generation helper get rid of all of the mess you face when generating a rig like all of the layers are enabled, some bones are set to quaternion while others are set to other, and every time you regenerate you have, to, you have to go and set the defaults again. Now for the weight painting you have the mesh cleanup operators, all of these operators are designed to work on all selected objects and at the same time. Some characters may contain thousands of objects so this is really useful. Characters usually contain extra data that is not useful anymore like custom normals, scope mask data, skin modifier data or weird auto smooth settings. You can select everything in your scene and use these operators to make sure that all of that data is gone. And you also have the waiting tab that offers amazing tool for weight painting your model. For example it gives you the ability to see the, the armature while weight painting. The operator also enables the visibility of the deforming layer of the Rigify rig. So you can go ahead and immediately control click on the bone that you want to weight paint. The add-on got a new update that made a few changes to the interface. The dev separated the operator list into three categories which are character, weighting and cleanup. They also added hints about what sort of selection the operators are meant to be used on. So for example on the cleanup category we see zero selected so this gives us a hint that these operators work on all selected objects. They also added the new operator which is toggle modifiers and this one works on the entire character and it's meant to be a replacement of simplify since the devs got tired of the limitations of the simplify tool. The update also comes with tons of other features and improvements that you can check out on the add-on page on Blender Market. Now if you want to check out this add-on, link is in the description. Tell me in the comments below what do you think about this add-on. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this one. Thank you for watching and goodbye.